hey guys what's up? welcome back to the channel in today's video guys i'm gonna show you guys how to fix a profile that required dlc to be loaded i can't load your profile because it's telling you that you don't not have dlc or it require you to have dlcs i'm gonna show you guys what i mean and i'm gonna show you guys how to fix it now right now guys i'm here let's see i have a few profiles here i have peru i have peru profile now let's see if this gonna load or it's gonna tell me that i need that i need dlcs dlc is the last time i get some dlc but it messed up my game messed up my profile so i had to get rid of it so in today's video guys that's what we're gonna be showing you guys how to fix okay so right now it said that it's signing in no as you can see here it said missing dlc detected no matter where i go i can't load any safe data because missing dlc it's missing dlc detected what this means is that if i click load here is the two dlc it says missing at the moment no pay attention closely to what i'm gonna be doing guys because it's going to be step by step for some of you guys it may be complicated but it's a simple step and a simple fix to it i'm gonna have a download link in the description for a software that you're gonna need the link for that is going to be down below in the description now this is what you need to know you're gonna need to know your your profile name so my profile name right now that i'm trying to load is dt12 peru now knowing that what we're gonna do is that one we're gonna go ahead we're gonna exit the game yeah yeah let's just completely close the game now with your game closed you're gonna need to go you're gonna need one file for this you're gonna need this s i s i i d crypto and you're gonna need to find your game profile now to find a game profile you basically go to this pc from this PC, you're gonna go documents, find the game file, whether it's AT, whether it's American Truck or ETS2. This works for both games. So in this case, I'm doing it on American Truck. So I load American Truck, go to profiles. In profiles now, as you guys can see here, there is a number of profiles here. You can go modify by date. Yet we're just gonna show either the newest one at the top or at the bottom. Now in my cases, mine can be much easier. In your cases, you guys might have to be going through and doing a simple step. So first thing we're gonna need to do right here, guys, is that we're gonna need to copy the s i i d crypt copy it you don't want to cut then you're gonna go here and you're gonna place it in your profile folder yeah so i go profiles i select a profile and then i place it in now this one note right here that says profile that s i i you're gonna need to right click and hold it drag it to the siid crypt now that what that happened so fast that you might don't even notice it but what that do is open the file so that you guys can get access to all the information in it it's gonna be readable editable now that already did that just did now i'm gonna go ahead and click on it and open if you don't open like with like this let me show you how to do that so you're gonna go right click you're gonna go open with 
and then you should say then yarn might don't say use notepad but in case it don't you click more option and the more option you're gonna be needing to look for notepad and then you click notepad and it open up now as you see here this is a map the pro map so that's one in that i'm on the right profile right profile now don't pay attention to like anything else right here what you're gonna need to do is go all the way down to right here it's a profile name now the profile i want to hit it is dd12 peru which is the profile that giving me the dlc error that we can load it now we find the right profile so i'm gonna go ahead close this i'm not gonna hit it anything in that i'm gonna need to right click on the decryptor we're gonna click cut this time we're gonna go to save we're gonna go to auto save we're gonna go to one we're not gonna go to auto save drive drive or auto save job we're gonna go to auto save in auto save we're gonna pierce the decryptor right here underneath game and info we're gonna take the info drag it onto the decryptor good it just been decrypted now we can go ahead and open this up now open this up right here guys we get a list of things things now you're gonna go down to any week go down to the lines that you see mark dlc's so right here you can see all of these down here mark dlc's you just need to highlight them just like that so to highlight if you're not a computer person you just need to click at the start click at the start make sure it's the first deal the first line that's asking for dlc you click at the first line right here i don't know if you guys can see the mouse right here so you right click hold it and you drag your mouse come right down straight down you're gonna make sure that you get uh, all the dlcs in there now most of those dlcs are trucks but don't worry about that the game will automatically pick up back those and just hit backspace and just like that it's gone completely gone 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 so that's one thing done now all of these here are mods mods Note that this is saying 25, we know of name, but instead of counting 0 as 0, you're going to count 0 as 1. We're going to go ahead, change this 25 to 10. Then we go File, Save, Close. Now, with that done, you can go ahead and remove this. You can either just move it out. Or you can just delete it if you have a copy of it somewhere else. In my case, I'm just going to move it out. And I'm just going to exit the profile. So to exit the profile, you just need to click on an other file directory right here. I say example, I just click on desktop folder right here and it exit that. No, that is completely done. Now, you're going to go back to your Steam they're gonna launch your game and just wait for it to launch right here as soon as it come up you're gonna see that the problem is completely fixed and this work for dlcs this work for mods that require dlcs trust me if you can get all if you can open the mods to deactivate the dlcs you will get the mod to work without having all dlcs no as you guys can see here here is my dt12 peru the one that i just edit the one that weren't loading and i'll make sure that this video is not edited this is the complete raw recording video no editing none of that is done to this video as you guys can see there's not even an intro in this video yeah not even an intro in this video so here i have my dt12 peru profile i'm gonna go ahead and load this
No, pay attention right here now, guys. Okay, this is taking a little while just to load up because I'm currently recording. But that is the least of the problem. Anyway, the only, way, only reason it taking a little while to load up is because I'm recording and it's like processing all the save data that I just went ahead and hit it. Okay, signing in. Please wait. And there we go, guys. Profile is fixed and it's working. So no more restarting. Uh, you're gonna go have to go ahead and create a new profile because you end up losing some DLC that you didn't buy. You just go ahead and just do that to your profile and just edit the save data. Remove all DLCs from the save data and bam, your game starts loading right back up. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and make and make this completely load right in. Nice, 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 nice. Sweet, sweet. I can even go ahead and take a look at my map. Because this is a custom map and this don't require DLC, but the game itself won't let you play a profile or unless you have all DLC. DLC, so I can go ahead and hit drive. I'm just doing all this to show you that the profile is working as it should. So I, here I am currently in the profile that I couldn't get in a few minutes ago. So just like that guys, we are in. If you guys want to play with us on stream, you can either join us when we play in ETS or ATS. Just go ahead, hit us up on Discord. Link for Discord is gonna be down below in the video's description for anyone who wanna join. So that's how you fix the LC issues with any one of your profiles on ETS and ATS guys for completely free. Completely free. Don't require anything much to do. Just have to get the decryptor, head into your profiles, find your save data and just edit it from right there and it will load. So with that guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to drop a like I'm going to be live tomorrow playing ETS 2, which is March, which is the 8th. Yeah, tomorrow is March 8th. I'm going to be playing ETS 2 live. Main map, see all the all main map, all mods we're using are Steam mods. So if you guys want more information about those Steam mods, you can check us out on Discord. Link for that is in the description or on our YouTube page. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys next time.